Spencer, I'm the head men's basketball coach at Fayetteville State University. Um, brought the basketball team out for com community service here at True Vine Ministries uh, to help, you know, promote Fayetteville State University, our basketball program, our athletic department, in, in serving the community come out to, uh, to uh, help True Vine Ministries in feeding the homeless. It's not just about basketball. It's bigger than basketball that we're able to come back and give back to the community to give back to people that has less than you have, and also to give back without looking for something in return. First of all, in order to be great, one has to serve first. And uh, we're trying to make sure we instill that in, in our players, that if they see some people that are less fortunate from, than, than they are, and that they see a need, that they can go out and service that need. And, and not only for basketball, but for life in general, uh, when, they get, when they leave Federal State University. My favorite part is basically the, the smiles on people's faces, knowing that they can come in, see the basketball team of their hometown, actually coming in, interacting with them, feeding them, laughing with them, talking to them. It's like, even though they're going through a, a rough patch in life, they know that it's a group of young people that support them. Uh, my favorite part has been really not practicing. It's like a, coach, a joke for coach. Just doing it out to love your heart because, you know, a lot of people don't got what we have or didn't have this opportunity, but to be able to give back is bigger than basketball. Well, you know what, just being here, I think being able to see the look on, on some of these folks' faces as, as they see our team, see our players here, and they're just sitting down and our guys are serving, serving them and because they don't get that. And, you know, they're out here on the streets. A lot of them on the streets, they're homeless, and they don't get that service. And to be able to see the look on their face and the enjoyment that they got from, from just being around these guys, they think that these guys are, are, you know, like celebrities to them a little bit. So they've been asking to come to games and come see us play, things of that nature and that's something that we'll try to make happen. On the head, you gotta get your tail on. Okay, come back again. Well, I tell you what, we'll be excited. We'll be exciting. We're gonna try to get up and down the floor and score some easy baskets when we need to. And I think we got the type of athletes now um, on our team to where the fans are really gonna enjoy coming and watching these guys play. We're gonna be tough, hard nosed on defense, getting after people defensively, and. Uh, and as a team, as a whole, you'll see guys that it, it may be a different guy every night that'll step up and, and, uh, and make things happen for us, which is, which is okay. We'll definitely be a, a team. Uh, we'll be together as one. Uh, I think about intensity. I think about love for the game. I think about brotherhood. I think about wanting to win. I think about changing the culture. I think about winning championship. There's a lot that comes to it, but the biggest thing is really winning championship, changing, changing the social statistic that we can't win. Well, I, you know, I, I just think right now, um, in the process of, 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 of changing the culture and in and, and, and the process of building a program again, you know, Phil say we, had, we haven't won a CIAA championship since 1973. And in order to build that culture, to build that championship culture, you get, it starts with things like this, you know, the little things. The little things make a big difference. And, you know, I, I just really believe that we're going to turn this thing around. We have good, good kids in our program. They're good students. They're good basketball players. And I think when you build a program around that, then, then you're going to be, eventually you're going to be successful.